Okay, I'm here with Donovan White Builder, and he's going to show me how to uh, cut this asbestos sh uh, shingle here. He's using a specialized tool. What is that, Donovan? It's called a hardy, hardy shears. A hardy shear, but like the little scissors. Okay. And what he's done here is he's taped this. Why did you take this? Because it's a narrow piece. This stuff is rather brittle, and so the tape helps it from to not break. Okay, and you're going to kind of just snip it across. Yeah, you'll see. Alright, let me stand back here. You got your breathing mask on. Man, that really reduces the dust. I was expecting far more, far more dust to fly on that. Yeah, that's the whole point. Well, let me see this thing. Oh yeah, I just turned, snipped it off. Okay, and that's the piece you're going to use, the small piece. Yeah, that's why I taped it. Okay, so so taping it's the key part of the lesson, and using the right tools is the lesson also. Well, the, the, that tool just doesn't kick up a lot of dust. No, it doesn't. You know, then that's the problem with hardy or, or the cutting these asbestos shingles. It's the it's the fine particles that's created by uh, a saw. Right, right. That that you breathe, and that just re that just uh, el eliminates a lot of the dust. Now, will will that thing cut this size hardy too? No. Okay, just basically the shingles only. Right. Okay. Now you use a hardy blade. A hardy blade? This yeah, use something blade. like that. Okay. Fiber cement blade. Yeah. Thanks. Appreciate the, uh, the help on this.